welcome, welcome to our special drive-through open house. I am Dr. Michael Cherry, Chairman of the Imagination Institute. Hello. On your tour, you'll see how the five human senses can help capture your imagination. Go, go, can I go too? Absolutely not. Uh, this is one of our discoveries, the figment of imagination. Yeah, I know all about the senses. They're sight, sound, smell, touch, cookie, cookie, go, and taste. Taste like chicken. Can I go? Please, please, please. No, I don't want you out of my sight. Out of sight? Okay. Come on, everybody. Here we go. Figment, you are not to interfere with the tour. Our first stop is the sound lab. We'll begin by testing your hearing with a series of tones. Left ear, right ear. Left, right. What? This is odd. Um, hello? Hello? Who is this? It's Figment. Figment? I thought I told you not to interfere. But you've got it wrong, Doc. It's not about listening with your ears. It's about listening with your imagination. Now I've completely lost my train of thought. No, you haven't. It's over here. All aboard. Woo Next stop, imagination. For every sound, your ears are hearing. A thousand thoughts can start appearing. And each of us imagines different things from just the sound. Your mind. Continuing now, if I may, in a calm, scientific, frequent-free manner, the feelings we see with our eyes can control the eyes of the imagination. Uh, let's begin by using the eye chart to test your vision. Now, all together, if you would please read line three and hit With that G-N-T, you can see things differently. <laughs> sure, you can see with your eyes, but imagine what you could see if you used your imagination. Follow the bouncing figment. One spark of light can light your fancy. Your mind sees more than what your eyes see. Your sense of sight can make your fancy fly. There's more to sight. Come on 
do? Oh, yes. Oh, thank you, Frickland. So, as you can plainly see, imagination works the best when it's set free. You said it, Doc. Imagination is a blast!